First of all, thank you very much for giving me time. First question is about interconnection market. Istanbul's interconnection market is expected to double by 2030. And what are the DECX case strategies to support this growth? The interconnection market in uh, Turkey mm -hmm. will double at least by 2030. I will say the expectations yeah. are even higher. Yep. And I will uh, justify this mm -hmm. with the past 10 years. We celebrate today 10 years DEX Istanbul. Yep. In 2015, when we started, mm -hmm. there was not a single interconnection mm -hmm. ecosystem well established uh, in the country. Today, we have the most vibrant in the region interconnection ecosystem with a lot of networks from North America, mm -hmm. from Asia, from Europe, from the region, and of course, all the Turkish players, relevant players are part of this ecosystem. So this gives us the confidence mm -hmm. that Turkey, Istanbul, has a perfect geographic position to play a significant role in the future as well, connecting the East with the West. Neutrality is contrary to Dekik's model. What challenges do you see in maintaining this principle in Turkey? We have not seen uh, a challenge at all, so mm -hmm. to be to say. Uh, we started in 2015 as the first licensed mm -hmm. uh, operator, mm -hmm. neutral operator of internet exchanges in Turkey. Mm -hmm. And this system has proven its important relevance for mm -hmm. growing the ecosystem. Neutral means that we operate the platform only. We are not an operator, not a carrier. Mm -hmm. We are not a telecom operator. We are not a data center operator. Mm -hmm. So all these are partners of us. So today, DICX Istanbul is a platform present on both sides of the Bosporus, mm -hmm. on the European mm -hmm. side, on the Asian side, in more than eight different data centers operated by different operators. This makes the beauty of the ecosystem, that mm -hmm. all the organizations, they want to join, they have plenty of choices. With the Amazon Web Services Cloud on ramp now live in Istanbul, what new opportunities do you expect and will other hyperscalers follow? Absolutely. They all will follow. For the gravity of the Turkish economy, for the mm -hmm. gravity of Istanbul and Turkey for the region, we will see all the other important names on the landscape, the big landscape of cloud hyperscalers, mm -hmm. but also other specialized, uh, specialized cloud operators. We will see even one more thing. We will see more AI applications to happen in Turkey. Mm. And DKX Istanbul is already AI ready. Yeah. Today I want to announce that uh, we have started the concept of the AI Internet Exchange available at DKX Istanbul that will allow uh, more localized training for better data sovereignty and security, but also the so-called AI in real time, AI in action, AI inferencing, mm to happen in Turkey and not to be brought from West Europe or Asia. What is the DECX doing to reduce risk and keep connections running smoothly? Very redundant. Mm -hmm. We use different paths across the, Barbaros, the Bosporus, operating with many different data center operators, with many different carriers, fully redundant. Mm -hmm. And one more important element is to keep the data and the traffic exchange locally in the country as much as possible. Mm. This is the greatest condition for data sovereignty and security and also the highest performance ever. The lowest latency, the speed of traffic exchange can happen always if the traffic is exchanged locally. Thank you very much. You're very welcome.